Today we're going to be going over all the brand new leaks that are supposed to come out in tomorrow's update. I'm super excited. All these leaks got me absolutely hyped up and I'm just super ready for this update. But like I said, we're going to be going over all of them. There's a ton of secret pets coming out, a ton of new features, just a bunch of stuff overall that's going to get you guys hyped up just like I am. So if you guys do want to enjoy this video, then make sure to smash the like button and click the subscribe button as well to support the channel because I would greatly appreciate it and we're on that road to 10k. So thank you if you do. Also, if you really enjoy pet catchers, trading, entering giveaways, and just overall want to be a part of my wonderful community, then make sure to join my Discord server by clicking the link in the description down below. Also, you guys know what time it is. I love doing these for you guys, and that is giveaway time. So, I'm going to be doing one last giveaway before this update releases tomorrow, and that's going to be for one last shiny Axolotl baggy. To enter this giveaway, all you got to do is like the video, subscribe to the channel, and comment your Roblox username in the comment section down below. This is your last chance of of winning one of these axolotl baggies on this channel before they leave and that's pretty much all to it the only other chance you probably have is by joining my discord server but when it comes down to youtube giveaways this will be the last one for the pets that are about to leave but best of luck to you guys i hope you win not enough yapping let's get into the video now i want to give you guys a quick disclaimer as well all the leaks i show in today's video are not owned by me whatsoever they're owned by either the bubble community which i will link their discord server in the description down below and also from the rumble studios discord so none of these leaks once again are mine and they are owned by other people and obviously i'm going to give them credit so they will be in the description down below now that i got that out of the way let's get into the actual video so the first thing we're going to get into is mythic pets now unfortunately mythics are not coming out in this update or at least the mythics we've already been shown isaac already stated that one of the devs that were supposed to help him with the mythics is unfortunately on vacation so he's going to have to delay the mythics until the next update not tomorrow's update two updates from now is when we're going to get mythic pets but i still want to talk about them in general they've been leaked they look awesome and i just want to cover them so let's get into them so there's already quite a few mythic variations of secret pets already the first one we got is the deep dark guardian the second one we got is the pearl goddess the third one is the captain's curse and the fourth one is the lord shock that's actually the first ever mythic version of a super secret as well and i'm really surprised they're bringing that out already because i mean leviathan and you know silly doggy and even immortal one was out before the lord shock and for some reason we're getting the lord shock first but I ain't complaining, it looks absolutely awesome. But that's not all the Mythic versions as well, and I think we might actually be getting this Mythic version in tomorrow's update, but I'm not completely sure. But this is a pet called the Bra Wisp, and it has a Mythic version already. Now keep in mind, this pet is not in the game yet, and it's already labeled as a Mythic, so it could be one of the pets we are getting in tomorrow's update, and might be the only Mythic we might be getting in tomorrow's update. But either way, I'm super hyped for Mythics, and we're gonna get into how they are actually created and how is this whole mythic system going to work. So one of the devs at Rumble Studios and actually works on pet catchers was the one that talks about mythics quite a lot and that is Blizzy or Blizzard. I think that's one of those two names. I'm pretty sure it's Blizzy, but either way, that is the dev. The first message we got here is from Blobby and he says, double the stats for a mythic secret is an L. It should at least be triple unless you have an eight times the full team you have. There isn't a point as you get more from those pets if they're your best pets now blizzy actually replied and said we're changing the way mythics are created so there is no combining so if you guys can remember in bubblegum simulator the mythics were added in a later update but you actually had to convert eight or ten pets into one to make a mythic version or you could hatch them as well but either way that's how you were able to make a mythic pet well i'm super happy to say that that is not going to be the same system in pet catchers thankfully because oh my goodness that was a waste of pets back then but either way that's not going to be the new system so the next message we got from blizzy once again says it's a unique concept that isn't just feed a pet a treat and hope for a chance so just like the golden cherries or the magic pendants it's not going to be something you feed a pet to where you have a chance of making it mythic and then they once again stated a message saying basically this and it's a picture of a top hat a in the middle of a bunch of items like the prismatic tome prismatic elixir some wild berries and a void cherry to maybe make a mythic pet i've also heard rumors of a mythic shard as well and we also got the new book as well which is called the evolve book 
or it's just labeled that and that has probably something to do with mythic pets as well so basically the moral of the story is that mythics are probably going to be happening when it comes down to combining items into it to turn it into a mythic pet but that's not all the message we got on the mythic system as well another message from blizzy says the old mythic method made it inaccessible for average players who doesn't want to spend all day trading for eight elders or eight pets in general so once again like i said that system is not going to be here no more so you won't have to get eight of the same pet just to make your pet mythic but that's all we got about the mythic pets i'm super hyped for them to come out i can't wait to hatch them or you know combine them you know farm them all that types of stuff and obviously i'll make about a million videos on them as well but either way we're going to get back into more of that once they're released in the game now enough of the mythic topic let's get into a bunch of other leaks which is a bunch of secret pets coming but before we do that let's get into some other features that are going to be added and some different stuff that we're going to be able to do in this next upcoming update so one of the brand new things we're going to get in this update is a whole fishing branch inside of the talent tree so if you guys know the talent tree, that's where you can get a bunch of upgrades, spend your gems and all that stuff. Well, we're going to get a whole section dedicated to fishing. So we could get like fishing luck, maybe like fishing speed, more fish or, you know, something like that. Or maybe sell more, all that type of stuff. Either way, we're going to be getting a bunch of fishing upgrades. So I'm super hyped for that, especially when they keep bringing secret pets and adding them into the fishing area, just like Beach Boy. We're also going to be getting a new secret pet as Beach Boy will be replaced and will be limited from the then on so definitely keep an eye out for that but hopefully it's a really good pet we don't know what it is yet another thing that's gonna be really awesome this next update is a brand new quest line so if you guys remember the maka o maka mika maka moo you know that type of invasion that event they had where you could get a ufo and you could also get the universe sentinel but we're gonna have another quest line and that's going to be bra invasion and they're also bringing back the ufo mount but this quest line is going to have another secret pet that's going to replace the Armageddon quest line and that pet as well. But either way, we're getting a brand new quest line and hopefully the pet is really good as well. So the first secret pet that we got off the start is called the Paradise in a Bottle. So this could be the new fishing pet maybe. I feel like that would work out for it, but I'm not really sure. But either way, this could either be, you know, the easy secret, the fishing secret, or something along those lines but this is one of the new secret pets added the next secret pet we got is called fire wings and it doesn't have all the parts that were loaded with it but this is kind of what the pet would look like if it was in the game it doesn't have a face unfortunately but it does look pretty cool kind of looks like a sentinel mixed with uh like something like the serene wave kind of something around there but either way the pet looks really cool so here's actually two drawings of two brand new secrets that are coming out and i'm not sure if i already showed these already i could because these are actually drawings and the ones i've shown so far are in-game photos of what the model looks like but the first one we got is called the summer solstice so this pet looks absolutely insane if it looks exactly like this drawing i'm going to be hunting my heart away hatching my life away and trying to get this pet because that looks absolutely amazing the next secret pet that we got is called the malevolent cosmic this thing actually looks insane as well and it kind of looks like the photo i showed you guys of the fire wings but i'm not really sure but that pet looks really awesome if it looks exactly like this drawing but these already have been confirmed that these two pets are coming out in the game we just don't know exactly what they look like but hopefully look like those drawings the next secret pet that we got doesn't have much of a name and it's kind of basic as well but it's called the dragon so i personally don't know how i feel about this pet i'm really hoping there's more to this model because it doesn't look like a dragon at all kind of just looks like a duck with like dragon eyes or something i don't know but this pet is one of the brand new secrets coming out they did say the parts are not all loaded once again but hopefully I really hope they do have something added onto this pet because oh my goodness. The next pet we got, just like the long cat that actually came out a while ago, which was a Robux pet, we got the long bro. Now this pet is actually cool. I think this is going to be a Robux pet once again, but it does look pretty cool. Now speaking of bro pets, another pet we got is called the heroic bro. So once again, a few parts did not load with this one, but you can see a little bit of a superhero mask on it. But either way, this is another pet that's coming out and this will probably be a robux pet as well but maybe not now the last and final secret pet that i got for you guys that i think looks absolutely insane and that is called
called the Infinity Wisp. So this pet right here looks crazy. I don't know, in some way, I just see this pet looking like Kyogre from Pokemon, so I don't really know, but either way, this pet looks really cool. Once again, the parts didn't load, but either way, this is what the concept of the pet looks like. And that is all the secret pets leaked as of recording this video. More could come out after this video is released. But either way, that's all the secret pet leaks I got for you guys. That's basically all the leaks in general as well. There is a summary of basically what's coming to this update. Like I said, we're getting a new bra quest line. We're also getting new global secret pets, new festival secret pets, and a brand new set of new Atlantis secret pets. So you guys already know that Atlantis rotates every update and we get new limited secret pets that get added. We're also going to be getting a new set of secret pets when it comes down to the festival area. So all the plushies, Axolotl, Baggy, and and Robot 2.0 will be leaving us, unfortunately. So we'll be getting a new set of secret pets there. We're also going to be getting global secret pets. So a lot of people didn't understand what this means. Global secret pets is just like the Easter secret pets or the St. Patrick's update, or just when they added like Doggy 1337. I think that was a part of the St. Patrick's update. Either way, global secret pets can be hatched anywhere. So that is what global secret pets mean. You can hatch them in every single area. It doesn't matter what area you're in, you will have a chance to hatch one of those secret pets. Some more stuff we're getting is a playtime milestone. So you guys know the milestones here. We're now going to be getting a playtime milestone to where it'll be like how many hours you spent in the game, and you'll probably get some cool rewards as well we're also going to be getting new shop items so the festival shop you guys know the bot in the box all these bundles and stuff will be replaced with brand new items in the shop that you can buy with more shell. Once again, the UFO mount is also coming back from the Maka Murata event they had. So we'll be able to get that again from bosses and mini games. And then, like I said already, we're going to be getting fishing talent upgrades as well in the talent tree. And that's basically all to it. As of recording this video, that is all the leaks that have been posted. So that concludes all the brand new update leaks that are going to be coming out in tomorrow's update. I'm super hyped for this update. It's it's absolutely amazing and I just can't wait to play it and get all the brand new stuff so hopefully you guys are as hyped up as me but that is all I got for you guys so I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and hopefully you found it helpful if you guys have any questions regarding pet catchers and or this video in general then let me know in the comment section down below without further ado this is the end of the video so make sure to smash the like button click that subscribe button and click the notification bell to never miss an upload thank you guys again for watching and I'll catch you guys all in the next video peace out everybody